Hey, what's up? Um, so, comment down below right now what you think is the highest ranked, like my favorite, and comment down below what you think is the least favorite of mine, of the season one of The Cool Coffee Reacts. And of course you could go look back at the videos, but that's what this one's for. So I'm asking you to comment down below because I'm gonna reveal the ranking a little later in the video. Just to get into it, I, uh, I th wanted to lay out some interesting comments about season one. So I had several different looks throughout this, the season slash through the year. <laughs> like I had a beard, I was bald, I had a goatee, I had hair. <laughs> so uh, I'll list right now what which videos had which look. So I just want to, I'd love to bring light to episode one, which was the pilot. So that was Lavaza. I did not give it a rating because um, it was, I didn't do a rating until next episode of Where Caribou. So I just wanted to make note of that. It's not in the rank, final ranking just because it, I didn't have a ranking with the tasting. Um, but I wanted to note that, uh, based on how happy I was with the beverage, with the coffee in the video, I would, uh, I would give it a 70. But, uh, it's not in the final ranking. Yeah, not in the final ranking, so. Oh, also, another one that I'm not including would be, uh, the bonus video that I did with my sister simply because it it's a bonus it's not an episode coffee sp it, it's a sp it's a special um so that's not included the bonus video had a ranking of an 85 and that was the four king and country limited edition coffee that they their father roasted and uh, Amber did not give a rating. It's, it's got a rating of 85 from myself. And another note, um, the another video, the other video that had a guest, the one and only, the real Seamus on TikTok, was the Silver Bridge video that was at his house, video with Seamus, that was the 614 blend. The Real Seamus gave it an 89, and I gave it an 88. I want to so. do a slight reveal. All right, here's the bag of my favorite. And in a little bit longer, I'll reveal the ranking. There are several different um, brew methods that I used throughout the season in different episodes, and that, that is going to be listed right now. Time for the reveal of my most favorite coffee of season one. It was Chameleon, the organic ground coffee. It was the, uh, it didn't have a name. It had a, I gave it a ranking, a rating of 98. Who knows if in season two, a coffee will go to a hundred or more. Who knows? And my least favorite was the bent tree. I don't have the bag for that. I was wanting to save all my all the bags, but um, I must have figured thought that after I started. So <laughs> I only have a few. Um, and um, without further ado, I'll give you the ranking. Everyone, in case you missed the 
season one. Somehow, I don't know why you would have missed it because you're watching the recap, but just in case, or maybe you just want to go back and watch it again, here is the playlist for season one. Just a note, it's about eight months long and um so i learned a lot about coffee in this in season one learned a lot about making making the videos so i there's a lot of growth from season from episode one to the end at episode 16 um it was a, it was a great time and I, I can't wait for season two hopefully you're you'll be there with me for that if you are and you want to be please be sure to subscribe there's the reason to do that. Anyway, this has been JK Boxed. Thank you for watching. I hope I earned your subscription by this content and happy brewing. I'll see you next time.